The learning objectives of this section are to familiarize all personnel involved in tank atmosphere control with preparing the indicators for use, making correct measurements. Recording the measurements properly. Issuing the correct permits. In this example, we are going to measure an inerted atmosphere after water washing. The ship is equipped with a flue gas plant. Prepare the indicators for use in respect of battery checks and calibrations, as per each indicator's instruction book. First of all, bring the oxygen analyzer, Servomex OA262, and the Recon 17HC to measure hydrocarbon by volume. Take measurements from at least three different sampling points from the three levels of the tank. Record the average reading on a form and on a flammability diagram. The reading in this example was 2% by volume. Take measurements from at least three different sampling points from three levels of the tank. Record the average reading on a form and on a flammability diagram.
The reading in this example was 16.5% by volume. Because we are using the Recon 17HC in an inerted atmosphere, we are instructed to reduce the reading by 2.5%. Average hydrocarbon content reading equals 16.5% by volume. Reduced by inert factor equals 2.5%. Average measured hydrocarbon content equals 14% by volume. Record the average reading on a form and on a flammability diagram. Follow the procedure from Learning Objective Flammability Diagram regarding inerting, measuring and venting. When you are sure that the hydrocarbon content is well below LEL, continue the measuring using the Oxygen Analyzer Servomex OA262 and Recon GP204 Explosimeter. Continue to measure until the hydrocarbon content is 0% and the oxygen content is 21% by volume. Remember to record the measurements as you proceed. Choose the tube corresponding to the toxic substance you want to confirm. Follow the instructions of the tube and record the measurement. The tank is now ready for entering. Before entering, remember to issue the permits relevant for the work to be done. Also remember to make ready the standby safety rescue equipment to ensure communication is established and that the entering crew are wearing appropriate protective clothing. After completion of the tank inspection the tank must be re-inerted to an oxygen content below 8% by volume, according to the regulations in force. You have now